today's video I'm going to show you on the Samsung Stratosphere how to install uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery on this device and you're going to do it using a program called Odin. Now, first thing you're going to want to do here is have a prerequisite met which is having super user installed. Now I just did a video on this um, so you can actually install super user before you install this custom recovery image so what we're going to do is you're going to install that right there get in super user installed make sure it's all functioning watch that video uh, if you haven't done that already um, then we're going to go into ES file manager which you probably would have downloaded if you did that last video same kind of thing and you're going to go to tools and make sure that root explorer is turned on right there root explorer and then make sure that mounts you have all these checked and as long as you have all that stuff done we're going to go down here and we're going to take this file right here it's called install recovery go to properties make sure that's the install dash recovery dot sash and it is and then we're going to go to rename and we're going to rename this dot b a k at the end there so that's the backup and we're going to hit OK and it should be successfully changed. So what we've done there is we've basically disabled that files function and what that file does is that reinstalls and stock Android recovery after you flash a custom recovery and we don't want that. We want the custom recovery to stick. So we've got that done. Next thing you're going to do is we're going to get into download mode. So to get to download mode go ahead and power off the device. Alright, should be powered off. We're going to hold the volume down button and then hold the power button. And we should see this warning right here. And it talks about, you know, flashing custom uh, operating systems, blah, blah, blah. Warning, hit volume up to continue. So we're going to hit volume up. And that puts your device in download mode. Um, so some things you're going to want to look at up here are these little notes up top which says your product name, custom binaries downloaded, mine says yes one count because I did actually already flash this already just to try it out. It says current binary Samsung official so that means your operating system is the official operating system for this device. Again this is the Samsung Stratosphere by Verizon which is the SCH-I405. So we're in download mode. Let's go over to the computer, see what programs we need to have installed, and get all that going so we can flash this custom recovery. All right, so we're over here on the computer. Um, the program you're going to need is you're going to need to download two things. So one of them is this Strat Clockwork Mod Recovery .tar md 5 The other thing you're going to need to download is this Odin file, and it's right here. And then the last thing you're going to want to do is download the Samsung drivers. Uh, I'm not really going to show you those right now. They're in another file system for me. Um, but anyway, I'll get you links to all of them. They'll all be in the video description. So you're going to have these files. You're going to install them all. Um, the drivers, you'll just do an install. This file, you'll just download. And then this one will be a zip, and you'll just extract it. And it'll look like this. So this is the program you want to get to eventually here. And you're just going to go ahead and click on it. All right, so we're good there. Um, and we'll open this up. So the next thing you're going to do is you're going to hit this right here and it says um, auto reboot, uncheck that. F reset timer, uncheck that. Then go to PDA, click it. Find the file you downloaded, the strat clockwork mod recovery file. Hit open. And the program is going to do a couple things and it checks it and makes sure it's all good. Make sure all this goes through here correctly. It says check MD5 is successful leaving CS. So we've done all that. Um, so let's go ahead and shoot over here to the phone again. Okay so at this point guys go ahead and plug in your USB cable to your computer and then plug it into your device. Also very important before you start this process to make sure you have good battery life. Super important make sure you have good battery life. Let's go back to the computer now. We got our plugged in. Okay, so now we're over here. One thing I want to show you and see if you noticed is that right here under IDCOM, 
you have a com and a number. It doesn't really matter what number that's there. It just should see a com and something should be in this category right here. You can also see ID and it says you have an added com port right there also. Um, if you haven't, the first time you plugged in your device in download mode, you're probably going to install some drivers. You know, you'll have a little thing over here flashing. This is Windows 7. It'll say there's drivers installing. So make sure all that stuff goes through, all your drivers get installed, and you see your COM port right here. Super important. Once you guys have that, just go ahead and hit the start button. And it's going to just do a couple things. You can see some stuff going on up here, flashing recoveries, some resetting. All right, and then it says right here, success, one, fail, zero. Um, so that means this is actually done. It says pass, so that's it. That's the program. Let's go ahead and go back to the device, and I'll show you how to finish this up. You're going to see right here, it actually says download complete. When it says recovery verification fail, um, it's actually okay. That's fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to unplug the cable now. And we're going to hold volume up and down and power. All right, just hold them, and the device should go ahead and do a reboot. And you're going to see the Samsung logo, if I can remember correctly, once. And then I think you'll see it a second time. And then we'll let go of it. Keep holding the uh, volume up and down, but you can let go of the power. And voila, this is Clockwork Mod Recovery version 5.0.2.7. And here you go, that is your recovery system. At this point, you can go ahead and go through all the options in this thing and do an Android backup, or, you know, do a restore, you can flash a zip, you can do all that fun stuff that you can do in recovery. Um, I'm not going to go through all that right now, I just want to show you guys how to get it on. And to get into recovery from now on, now that you have the recovery installed, once from a powered off state, you just hold those volume up and down and power, watch for the second Samsung flash, let go of power, keep holding and you'll boot up like this. So anytime you want to get into custom recovery, that's how you do it. There you go, that is my video on installing uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery on Samsung Stratosphere. As always guys, Root Junkie. Check me out right there. Got lots of goodies down there constantly updating Facebook and Twitter on the other side. And we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.